Alright, so you can absolutely buy this. But why buy it when you can make it? Huh? Three inch pop up board, two drawer glides, a little bit of clinkity clanky, some hooks. Of course, mine and uh, you know don't adjust. I did have a plan for that, but our drawers were just short enough to where if I did my plan, they would butt up with the bottom. Either way, when we get something off of the middle, just rotate off to the side and take it off, drop it in. They'll clink and clang and jump, drop into their uh, hanging spot there, and you're done. Let's close it up. Put all your pot lids and pan lids and stuff down here around the sides. Maybe make some type of wire rack or something to go around there to hold those. Keeps them out of the way. I don't know. But it's late. I'm tired. But I think Mama is going to be a little bit happier with that when she wakes up. I know I would be. That's not bad. What do you think? Yeah. You tired too? A little bit. Okay. We're tired. Turned out pretty good. Um, I don't know how much it cost so far. Probably, uh, I think it was like a $20 guide. A uh, pack of these. I think four were in each was like four or five bucks. And wood was minimal. I mean, it was it's just poplar. It's nothing too crazy. Actually, the centerpiece here is poplar, and uh, this is a one and a half inch piece that's in here. And um, these were actually, I think they're two and a half standard or actual size, but. I notched them to fit up underneath the cabinet and for our cabinet, you know, which is not beautiful, but I piloted those holes there, screwed into the top portion of this rack. And the rack up inside there has another uh, pine piece that runs across the top. That's all glued and brad nailed from the side. And then at the back, I left a tongue that hangs down a little bit lower. And our cabinet's thick enough in the back that has a three quarter inch piece of plywood on the back so it can just uh, screw directly into the back so those two screws in the back hold it up in the rear and uh, we measured down with the top floor out we measured down from the uh, top of the granite or from the bottom of the granite to the top of the new structure we made uh, to make sure that it was um, uh, level however I did uh, offset it slightly to the rear so that it wants to close a little bit easier. It's like I'm, I'm barely having to push it here. And it's supposed to be once you get it there. Yeah. Let's see my battery. I'm about to die. It's supposed to be once you get it to here, though. It's supposed to just close itself. Yeah, there you go. Close itself. Nice and pretty. Except for this uh, ugly dated bottom here. We're going to do something about that. Anyways, it's nighty night time. Goodbye, everyone.